Um, and today we're going to show you how to make broad bean and mint dip. And I have Iona and Ema helping me today. So, shall we harvest them? Yeah. yeah. So, these are um, field beans, which are a slightly smaller version of broad beans, basically. I should say that some people have an allergic reaction to broad beans. So, if you're aware that you have something called favoritism, obviously don't eat this. Um, but otherwise, you should be fine. <laughs> So, we're going to try something new. Um, and normally I would pull the whole plant out when I'm harvesting them, but I've been told recently that if you cut them off close to the ground level, they may throw up more shoots and you might get a second crop. So we're going to try that. So this is the broad bean plant, um, and it's got obviously, you know, these leaves and these beans. Now these are smaller than standard broad beans would look. Um, and what we're going to do, girls, is we're going to cut it off down here. Okay. Ooh, we'll do it together. Well done. Cool. Okay. These together. Right, oh, there we go. We've done it. We've got our harvest of beans now. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick a bean stalk each. Right? I know a story about a bean stalk. It's called Jack and a Bean Stalk. Yep, exactly. Do you think he climbed up these ones? Yeah. So we're going to take the beans. Yeah, and, and, and there's a giant up there. Yeah. So we're going to pick all the beans off the stalks and we're going to throw them into that basket. Okay. And we're going to throw the stalks and leaves in there and we'll put them in the compost. Okay. So now we're going to shell these. So pick a bean. And then. I'm going to be in the video. Yeah, go on. open them and there you go and because these are field beans not broad beans you're probably only going to have like three or four in each pod we have our bowl of beans and mint leaves the only other thing you need is garlic just a clove you don't want to overwhelm it so, I'll do too close because it's tiny. So, peel your, peel your garlic clove. If you're using a, um, a sort of powerful blender, you don't even need to chop it, I'll just chop it in half. Stick it in. And then, stick in. Beans and mint leaves. <laughs> I can't do something simple. Shake around. Now, some people would um, shell all the beans before they did it, but personally, I quite like the kind of rustic. And there you go, and that's it. Oh. Okay, and here we are with the finished product. So we're going to try it on oat cakes. Do you want me to do it? Pass me the spoon a minute and I'll get the... What do you think? I think, Leona. <laughs> <laughs> well, I like it. <laughs> 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 